Hello you beautiful people and welcome back to Let's Play The Last of Us Part 1 where we Beggars. need to put on some energy to open up this gate. Luckily enough we yep, can go through here. Maybe, just maybe. Yeah, that's what I figured. And I am expecting obviously to find some Infected here, whether they're just gonna be hunters or clickers, I am gonna probably walk into them, I assume. Okay, as good as the maps are, a map of the UEC campus with circle areas and handwriting on it, top getting slammed here must beef up barricades bottom infected slipping through here need to reinforce the stadium and bookstore exits i looked already here right yeah Okay, we can't go higher. do we have here? 18th of January, 9 got a month of waiting and still nothing. No word from anyone. Found some additional cans of food in the dining commons. They won't last. Had an incident at the Eastern Hall barricade, but everything's still secure. The 31th of January, I caught a glimpse of a group of those things running around. I saw one that looked like Heather. Maybe it was Heather. But 10th of February, since batteries are running short, they have no listening. They are now listening to their radio once a night. I gave up on that since the last broadcast. Three bleeding month. Why do they bother 25th of february cheryl was smoking out yesterday said she needed it she got pissed when i threw out her stash she doesn't get it we need to keep a clear head here someone's going to have to go into town and get more supplies it's probably going to be me wonder how long you held out pick this one up so it would be cool if we actually would find a close combat weapon here there's a comic right or is it a brewery Ah, Dawn of the Wolf, it's the movies in this game. It I for a second thought why ever Iron Man, but no. I don't want to go. Ah! <laughs> 
One down, still a couple to go, right? Ideally, oh, a PlayStation, hello, a PlayStation 3. Ideally, I am not going to use bullets and everything in the near future, but I think it's going to... <laughs> It's gonna escalate quite quickly. I thought a little bit smart and if I'm utterly completely honest with you in the first second I thought this was a normal clicker lesson learned sorry we are gonna okay they're down all right good shall we actually try I want to say, shall we actually try what the flamethrower is going to do against a big dude? Obviously, bad idea, again. I mean, at one point, I am gonna, so to say, pull the big dude no matter what, right? Why don't I just try to... Take on the surrounding clickers before. And then face the big one by himself. I am relatively certain that there's no clicker around anymore, but obviously I can be freaking wrong here. I think in my back in the day playthrough, I haven't really used them shivers. Might have been a little bit of a mistake, especially at the upgraded part we are right now. They are quite good since we can use them three times. So we theoretically, if we are at three of them, we can kill nine. That is quite good, I would say. Okay, that was too goddammit close. I mean, he was too close, that is what I meant. Couple of good shots there. Ok, 
Come on, boy. Show yourself. Go back. Let him throw. Oh boy, alright, okay, good, good, good. Um, yep, I, the arrows I used might have been not the best thing, but well. So who do we have here? John Warren, alright, put it away. And I don't know if the game, when it resets, it obviously seems to close everything, but at least the things we already have looted stay looted. Still, I'm sorry, I know, but I still want to double check. That cannot be opened. Full. Okay, that door cannot be opened. I had somehow, maybe that's coming from a different game, I don't know. I somehow had the memories that the big dude was able to punch through walls or to through um, normal walls and everything. But maybe. It's possible that I have a different, different game there in my weird little memory. All right, that was it. Good. We at least... Okay, yeah, we died, but we did lose much of HP. I maybe wouldn't have needed to fight them. Okay, guys, that right now is then bringing us to the end of this episode. And you know it, I, as usual, really, really thank you for watching. If you guys actually do have enjoyed this episode, then please give me a little thumbs up and subscribe. And hopefully, and hopefully I see you in the next episode. Until then, have a wonderful day. Stay frosty. Bye.